Ellen and I calling Ranger Benny. Ranger Benny is far enough removed from Elle, we hope that he wouldn't be uh, a suspect. I'm OK, I'm ready when you are. Their first call is to Ranger Benny, an associate of Elle Arena's. Hello? Benny. <laughs> <laughs> Would we be able to come to your place tonight but yeah. and um, then do everything we were talking about tomorrow? Uh, I don't see why not. Amazing. Yeah. Perfect. Thanks so much, Benny. Let's see what happens between now and that time. Hopefully nothing. <laughs> we don't necessarily have to make the other calls, but it might be good because this phone then won't be connected to us. Right. After slipping Hi. through the hunter's fingers, Sonia and Ellarina have made it to the pickup point with Ranger Benny, who they plan to stay with for a few nights. Thanks so much. We are heading to Ranger Benny's house to stay there the night. Are you putting that in there, babe? No. I feel good about it. But I think I'm just on edge as well because we don't know how close they are to us and how close they could get to us tomorrow. First number's owned by Benny. So they made a five minute call. Wowie. Can you see if they're connected? Absolutely. They're friends on Facebook, so. You'd be assisting somehow? Uh, at Yarragon is where they live. Bang on. Yeah. Because I want to map his address immediately. Yeah. Just let all the intel marinate away around them and then we'll be ready for a fugitive feast and it'll be tomorrow. Yes, sir. No, come to me. Do you want to come up with me? No. <laughs> We're feeling safe enough right now. We borrowed Daniel's phone to call Ranger Benny on and the hunters wouldn't directly find where we are but it also is quite exhausting in a way, just being in a new place. Oh no, oh no, I just spilled this, I'm so sorry. I just spilled tea on your chair. Oh, oh sorry. I'm so sorry. It definitely does wear you down, but we want to win, we're determined to win, we want to keep our head in the game, and we're still just as motivated as ever to do that. I was just like, how did I just do that? I'm so sorry. Let me show you something. Ben he lives here at Yarragon, and then they're going to go to Bentigo, yeah? Yeah. That is 407 k's, and that's the four-hour window that we're saying. I can see where you're going with yeah. it. He's definitely going to supply a car. And if we then get eyes on the car, we know we're well and truly on. Well, I think that's a target for tomorrow, though. Yes. Yeah, I don't think it's now. Yeah, Roger. Coming in hot, Ben. We're coming in. OK, Sonia and Ellarina. Yeah, that, that intercept with Leroy was gold. They did call us stupid and dirty. No, right on one of those, Chief. Yeah, absolutely. We went back and had a look if there was anyone else called the time Sonia and Ellarina rang Leroy, and there was. Is Benny. He could be a really close associate of Sonia and Ellarina, and that may be their end point today. We're not sure. Yeah. First thing, we deployed Echo down towards... Um, um, Yarragon. Thank you and they can chase them all the way up to Bendigo if they have to. The Bendigo trap is going to be red hot. I think their days are numbered. Come by world. How good. Sonia and Ellarina are hiding out in Yarragon with their associate Ranger Benny, who has agreed to offer them some work in exchange for money. It's just a wild brew over here, folks. The wild one. Oh, cute. They're just chilling. We get to be junior rangers today in exchange for our accommodation and food and just being safe. I can see the security camera there. We'll just suck. We know this place is riddled with CCTV. We saw a lot on the drive-in. All right. Wow. Yeah. But we have uniforms and everything. We're very confident that by the time the hunters get the footage, that we'll be long gone from here. So we might even give a little hey as we're walking past them. A little wave to a few of them. <laughs> Hello, hunters. Oh, yeah. 
Echo, ops over. HQ, this is Echo. Just put that residence under surveillance at the minute. Uh, ops Echo, yeah, Roger. Team Echo has been dispatched to stake out the residential address of Ranger Benny. Now that address... Who's hungry? Me. But I'm always hungry. With military backgrounds, reconnaissance is their specialty. But so far, they have yet to secure any fugitives. Is that going to be it over there? That's correct, yeah. That, that last one? open side house there, yep. Gotcha. That's a high enough fence. Yeah. Our arena ain't going over that fence. No. The only one of us to get eyes on. Shit. Who's that? I don't know, but it looks like it's got pink hair. It's definitely the house. Mm. Who's that? Oh, it's a hat. Yeah, it's a hat. Well, you're right with the pink, though. Oh. Pink hat. I got you going a bit, mate. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. HQ, this is Echo. Echo, HQ. Stand by, stand by. Go get your, go get your pie, mate. No. Just do it. Okay. Just do it, because yeah. we'll take it with us. Yeah. Can you? Can I have a saucy drone and some tomato sauce, please? Yep. <laughs> Echo, ops over. HQ, Echo, the occupant of the home just put their bins out literally just now. She's a female, late 20s to early 30s. A vehicle in that location of interest. It is a golden-coloured small hatchback. I believe it is a Mazda. Over. Roger that. Uh, Race. Yes. That has just come back as confirmed as Fiona's vehicle, who is the wife of Benny. They're both associates. Party time. We are well in front of Benny. The other one is Ben's got a Skoda Octavia. We've identified what vehicle he has, and there's every chance that Sonia and Elorena are with him right now. Hi! Hello, you two. Ooh, what are you doing? Hello, things? big boy. These are our new range of hello. It is so nice to be out in the fresh air. We did basically spend the first two weeks indoors, hiding out, and I was definitely missing just being outside. Cool. So we're going to clean up a little bit. Uh-huh. I have to drain the water and then scrub it. Hopefully the hunter's on a completely different trail and they're not on us. Oh, what are all those bugs in there? Oh, so we scooped that out? Scooping out. Hopefully today we can get five, six, seven, eight steps ahead of the hunters. Gross. Just slow down a little bit for me. See how you can see the little oh, car I see there? the car there. Let's, just, the let's car. just turn around and sit off here, mate. This is perfect. This is way better. Magic. Now, those hay bales are in the way, so go forward for me. There you go, stop. mate. So I can get the old one knock on that one, buddy. <laughs> oh, mate. I love recon. It's magic. I can see everything. It's magic, isn't it? Those guys, Zach and Sean, two former reconnaissance soldiers. Oh, they but Very skilled in surveillance. Reconnaissance. They're investigators. The fugitives should be very worried of the hunter team and who is actually tracking them. HQ Echo, that little Mazda's on the move. We're going to follow that. Over. Yeah, Roger that. Good copy. Which way is it going to go here, mate? Oh, he's pulled up on the left. I'm sure, that's it at the front. It's good, very well. There she is. Yeah, that's it. That's it, 100%. Is this going in the shops? Oh, I should go and have a look at the house while she's here. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. Break, break. HQ, this is Echo. Request permission to go back and have a quick look at that house while there's nobody home over. Leave it, all right. I think... I, if, if we don't get anything today, they're going to Bendigo tomorrow, and that's like, we don't want to... My gut's saying, just leave it be. Uh, at this stage, team, no, just stay on current task. We just don't want to blow too many leads and get compromised over. HQ Echo, okay, good copy. I mean, that's a good place to drop a vehicle, right? We're hot on the trail of Sonia and Ellerina. Their exact location, we're not too sure, but we've got a number of trip wires set around their movements. So she's parked facing this way. So there's the car. We're quite happy for Sonia and Ellerina to think we're stupid because we're not, and they're going to get a big surprise. Be good to know where it worked. Can we find that out? Maybe type in um, Ben Yarragon. How do you spell it? Yarragon. <laughs> this episode of Talking Gippsland yeah. heads out to the township of Yarragon. Yeah. There you go. To catch up with Ranger Benny. Let's find out where he works. He's coming up. Gum fire. That's where he works. Here's Bellarina with him. Oh, look at him. Yeah. 
She's close, man. Here we go. Moving. Uh, she's turning around, mate. Do you want to give me... HQ, HQ, this is Echo. Hey, what do you got for us? So, just doing a little bit of open source on Ben. Turns out that he is a wildlife ranger at Gumbaya World. Did we know that? Did we know he was a ranger? That's the first I've heard of it, mate. I didn't know, didn't know what he did for a living. Did we know that Ben was a ranger? On Ben's Facebook profile, we've also identified a photo taken with El Arena and Ben at that Gumbaya world. Nice. Yeah, Roger, that is a uh, good intel gathering open source over. That work location is only 28 minutes from his house. And that park closes 1600. He should be home by 1700. We're just sort of wondering what he would be doing. Yeah, OK, no, that's a good pickup. If he's not at work, where the hell is he? Yeah. Sonia and Lorena don't know we are aware of Benny. Benny's vehicle, we think, is going to be used to travel to Bendigo. So we're well ahead of them. The Bendigo's red hot. We will, oh, we will right. get them in Bendigo, no doubt. It'd be nice to get them before. We don't have to worry till Tuesday. It's just time to be patient with Benny and let uh, the fugitives come to us. We're in the same location all day. The okay. hunters aren't going to like knowing that. They're not. Sorry, not sorry. After a full day of recon, Team Echoes still remain fixed on the target residence of Ranger Benny. The other thing is, we, you know, we see a vehicle pull into there. From here, we're not going to be able to tell how many heads. Unless they start turning lights on on the veranda. So if we go a bit closer on that same street there, so that approaches from the rear, it's unlikely that they're actually going to notice us and see us in the car because it's going to be dark. What do you think it makes? Yeah, we can't be sitting in the car. One of us could, one of us could be, you know, that tree. Well, I could just go on. and sit. I can just go and sit over there and I'll freeze my ass off and sit off the address. Yeah, wait till it gets a bit darker. Yeah, and then you go and park in. I'll have comms with you. Yeah. And then if they roll up, well, I can just literally get out, run over and grab them. Yeah. Have you got a black jumper? Yep. Sweet. Grab that. Go and grab that go in get preparation it. anyway. This wig is also very I itchy. I really want to take my wig off. Do you reckon we can take them off? We're going to be in the car. And then at Benny's. Yeah, OK, righto. The wigs aren't going to matter. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we're good being at Benny's place again tonight. Well, it's a good time to do it, because we're hoping they still think we're in Footscray. <laughs> ops, Ops, this is Echo. Echo, this is Ops. Hi, mate. There's still no movement at that house. Target vehicle's not in location. But we've lost observation of that house now. So I'm going to go into a single man night OP in a couple of paddocks just off to the east of the address. Sean's going to go and sit on the street if you reference your map. Um, we're just going to communicate by Channel 6. We want to let you know. That's all right. Happy to uh, hear your commentary anyway, so that'll be good. Yep. Okay. All right, no worries, Echo. Uh, let us know how you go. We'll uh, monitor your commentary. Thanks. Thanks, Reese. We need to go. I want to see Sonia and Ellerina out of the game. We need to free up resources. We need to free up our mind. Echo, they seem keen as mustard. Beautiful, beautiful. But I actually want this one more so for Echo. I think uh, their first one, it'll be great. Tomorrow will mark the end of week two, which means we only have one week left. I want to know which fugitives are left and how many hunters are on us. I don't know if I do. Do you not? just make us more nervous. Make us more panicked, yeah. And more, yeah, but I'm curious. Help. Yeah. I'm so curious. I'm going to wait for you to be almost in position, then up and just go and just grab the first person that gets out of that passenger side. Yep. As soon as you're behind here, mate, we can flick off the lights. I'll get out <laughs> and go. OK, Fleur, radio, good. Work phone, good. Good luck. Got this back.
You have to tell us when we need to start being on the lookout for cars, Benny. Yeah, boys. And so good that you know the back roads. We'll hit the outskirts of town in a few minutes. On the lookout. Yeah, Zach, this is Sean. I'm in position now, over. Roger, Sean. I'm about one minute out from position. Yeah, good luck with that, mate. Red Ute. Zach, Sean, disregard that vehicle. Don't move. Don't move. They are beaming us. I think they were coming up the hill. Oh. So we're just coming into town here. Oh, has it been night? Echo, this is Ops. Be aware there may be dogs on the property over here. Sean, Zach, I'm in position. I'm approximately 30 metres south of the driveway. I've got good help over the house. And I can get completely below level of the road. How many seconds to get to the driveway? Less than three seconds from my position of the driveway over. Yeah, good copy, mate. Sean, Zach, it looks like the front porch light has been turned on over. Mate, expecting guests. Right of us. Dead end street down there. Yeah, that's where the dirty hunters would sit in their car and wait. Vehicle coming up. Zach, Zach, vehicle just pulled in, mate. Oh, we came a different way this time. Vehicle pulled up on the side. Roger, all call signs, all call signs. This is Ops. When ready, go, go, go. Moving, Zach, moving. Sean's moving. This is Ops. When ready, go, go, go. Moving, Zach, moving. Game on. Sean's moving. Thank you for keeping us yeah, safe yet again. Ella Arena. Ella Arena. What? Your time on the run is over. Sonia, you've been hunted down. Your time on the run is over. Wow. <laughs> Boys, well done. That was a massive run. <laughs> we did give you a pretty good run, but what You're the welcome. hell? We were so confident. Excellent. Oh, how annoying. We were, we were meant to win. It's the chief here. How are you going? How's your night been, girls? Oh, well, our night was wonderful. Uh, we, we had a little surprise party for you. I'm glad you came. See, where's the party? Yeah, where is the party? <laughs> well, it's about to happen, I think, because uh, you guys can do whatever you like now. You're uh, in the bin and out of the game, and thanks for playing. We cannot wait to find out how you tracked us, because we've had a fun ride. Good job, by the way. Thanks very much. I'm pumped. That was great. I'm so happy for Echo. <laughs> Good job, Echo. Well done. Two X recon guys, you're not going to outsmart those guys on the ground. To get that first capture in the bag, I'm just really proud of them. Yeah, well done, team. Yeah, right done. Great capture, great capture. Ah, oh, stop clapping. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really happy with this capture. There's a lot of smack talk by the fugitives. Wow. But we are action people, and we capture. We could have walked ourselves to the car, you know. It's sad that our time has, like, stopped. Man. <sighs> we wanted to win. We wanted to last the 21 days. We wanted to make it to the extraction point together. Yeah. You still took a very long time to be able to find someone with bright pink hair. <laughs>